Hi, Mike McGinnis with Agriculture.com from McLean County, Illinois, and we're speaking with Herb Steppen. He is head of the GMS Laboratories. It's a laboratory that uh, does a lot of soil testing, and in this area of the Midwest, Herb's saying that there's uh, some concern about uh, significant loss or some, some loss of potassium in these fields. Uh, what are you telling your farmer customers? We started noticing that our potassiums overall uh, have been dropping <coughs> significantly, uh, probably somewhere in the 40 to 60 points on average uh, over the last, uh, from about 2007. And what we're, what we're thinking is that the wet springs and the wet falls that we've had is tying the potassium up. We don't think that it's, that it's uh, washed out or wet down the tile, but we just feel like with the weather conditions we've had, that uh, as we've warmed up this summer and we're getting and we're dry this fall, we're feeling like we're going to probably see the potassium coming back as far as the overall test. But it has been concerning to see the potassium falling over the last four years. So what's the remedy? Uh, just a, a maintenance uh, program, or are you are you asking farmers to rebuild their potassium levels? What we've asked our farmers to do is, even though they've been pulling off very good crops, as we've asked them not to panic give it a couple years and to just do a maintenance program on removal of the crop basically. Yes. Not to build, uh, to try to build it when we're not sure if the potassium is there or not. It's not a, we just don't feel it's an economical, especially with the price of uh, potting. You bet. Well, thanks for the update. You bet. You bet. Herb Steffen with uh, GMS Laboratories here in McLean County, Illinois for this uh, harvest update on agriculture.com.